Hi, I'm Jacqueline Pierce, author of What Animals Want in the Orca Think series. 65% of households in Canada and the US have pets. And of those, over 90% think of the pets as part of the family. Animals are important to kids, whether it's their own pets that they wanna take good care of, or it's animals they see around them, farm animals, zoo animals, wildlife. They might also have questions about animal issues. What animals want helps kids think about animals' needs from food and water, healthcare, safety, comfort, to things that animals need to do to make them happy. And how do we know what makes animals happy or sad or distressed? Well, we might be able to pick up clues through their body language and behaviors or their vocalizations meows and barks and squeals, but sometimes it's hard to read the signals. Animal science can help us. Scientists are now able to check for stress hormones in animals so they can tell when an activity is stressful or when it reduces stress. They can do preference tests which help tell which foods or what activities animals prefer. And these kind, this kind of information about different animals can help us make decisions and think about the animal's needs. The book was developed with the BCSBCA, the British Columbia Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Animals, which is well known around the world for their humane education programs. And the book also focuses on or uses the five freedoms, which is a framework recognized around the world that helps people look at animal welfare. And it's also based on the latest findings in animal science. The information is presented in kid-friendly language with concrete examples, photos and uh, engaging illustrations and it, fun facts. And it also gives um, examples of things kids are doing to help animals and also things that other people in the community are doing to help animals. So there you have it in a nutshell, what animals want.